Hi, welcome to the channel. So today we are going to talk about two things, uh, how to create a file with date and time in the file name and how to add timestamp in the name of an existing file. So for creating a, a file with date and time in the file name, we have two modules in Python. Uh, one is date time and one other one is time. So inside date time module, we have one class called date time and inside that class we have called now function so we'll use it and we'll see how it will work uh, so from date time module we are importing date time class and let's create a variable here and let's see how what it gives date sorry date time and then there's a function called now So let's see what this uh, piece of code is giving us. It is providing us the date along with the timestamp. Suppose we don't want to put the date and timestamp in this particular format in our file name. So what do we do? We use another function called strf time, which allows us to uh, provide the format. And here I'm providing the format, which is year month and date and then hyphen and hours minutes and seconds so now let's see like earlier we have this format and now let's see if there's a change in the format oh there's a change in the format so this this looks uh, better than the previous one let's put this in our file name uh, now i uh, will create a variable called file name and um, let's think about what file name we want to put so suppose I want to create a file name called uh, my data and then in the file name I want to put this time string variable which contains date and time and I want the extension of my file name to be dot text let's see if it is what it is printing if we print the file name okay so this is perfect this is uh, something that I want my file name to be and now I will just create a variable and then create this file so what is the file that I want to create file name has the name of the file inside it and you have to give uh, mode in uh, the open function when you want to create a file so let's run it and let's see oh we have a file name called my data and that contains timestamp and it is created a seconds ago so this is how our code worked fine now coming to the second module which is uh, time so let's import time and let's take another variable called time str1 and now with time uh, we will use the function and let me copy and paste from here itself and now let's print what we have in time str1 okay so this is also giving the same uh, format that was given by the date time module and so we can go by this way also and then we can try to create like uh, another file let's try to create another file let's call it file name one and call it my data with time module and so let's see how this code works Okay, so uh, this is our file name, uh, the newly created file name and let's see if it is created. Oh, I have a file that is created a second ago and file name is also what we expected. So it's good. Now coming to renaming a file uh, which is already existing in our system and we want to put timestamp into uh, 
uh, that file name. So for that, for renaming a file, we uh, use Python module called OS. First, we'll be importing OS, and to rename, we'll be using a method from the module OS, uh, which is a rename. Okay, let's see. Uh, we have a file called data.txt here, so we'll try to rename that file only. So what do want? What do we want to rename? We want to rename a file called data dot text. Okay, and we want to put a timestamp into it. So let's copy paste this code and okay. Here also we have. Uh, our time date and timestamp in this uh, time str1 variable and okay change the variable name okay we could keep the same also that's not issue so now uh, what we want our changed file name to be so we want it uh, we want to take uh, the first portion of the file name the file name prefix from here only so how to take it we'll just write file name and we will use the split function and how we are splitting it we are splitting where we are getting uh, the dot and then we are taking the first half of it so that will be zero we are taking the prefix so let's see what is let's let's see what is the changed file name what does this change file name variable contains right now so I'll just run this and oh it just contains it contains the prefix okay so after the prefix what we wanted we wanted to add time string and after the time string we wanted to we want to add actually dot also and we want to add the extension same extension so here we can put one you can just this is a simple file name you can just put here dot text and just concatenate it but if uh, you want to generalize the code and you want to just take the prefix and the suffix and uh, you don't know what suffix can it be so this this particular will give us data and if we keep one here then this will give us uh, text let me show you let me show. okay now let's see okay so we can see we are getting uh, data because we have taken this then we are getting timestamp because we have taken time them str2 uh, this variable and then we are getting dot and text because of this portion of the code okay so now let's rename the file so for renaming we'll just call function rename and then we'll keep our source file name and uh, what is the target name that you want to give to our file so let's run this code oh the code executed properly and let's see yeah our file name got changed thank you for watching the video see you in the next video